changes and a reminder to lock your car doors no matter how quick the trip. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Krista Bame. Warmer temperatures may mean more outdoor activities for you and the family, but for police it means a spike in crime, specifically car break-ins. Today alone, back-to-back break-ins within an hour in the same spot. Fargo police say it's unusual to happen midday, but this may just be the beginning. Valley News Team's Christina Craig shows us what you can use to keep an eye out on crime. Unlock doors. Unlock doors. Allow unwanted criminals in. It's a crime of opportunity that can happen in your driveway or your neighbors. But you can go to the store where the crime rate is a little higher and it can boom, it can just happen to you. Keeping safety in mind, Yadira Burridge always leans towards the side of caution, looking out for her five-year-old's best interest. You can always be on the lookout for anything. Whether it's scoping out a new area of the city or taking a closer look at her own neighborhood. CRIMEREPORTS.COM ALLOWS BURRIDGE TO KEEP TABS ON CRIME IN HER AREA. THEY'D LET YOU KNOW THAT IF THERE'S CRIMES HAPPENING IN THE PARK BY YOUR NEIGHBORHOOD OR IF WE'VE TAKEN REPORTS OF uh, SOME DISORDERLY BEHAVIOR THAT YOU MAY WANT TO SEE THAT YOU DON'T LET YOUR KIDS GO TO THE PARK UNATTENDED. BE IN IN JUST A MINUTE, LET THEM IN. AND FOR THE MOST PART, THE SYSTEM STAYS UP TO DATE. CRIME REPORTS LAGS BEHIND ONLY BY A FEW DAYS, GIVING FAIRLY ACCURATE DATA. In total this month, 12 cars were broken into. CrimeReports.com pinpoints to the location where the theft happened and can filter a specific period of time. For example, seven incidents occurred in the last two weeks. Just like in the backyard or wherever, you know, things can happen anywhere. Uh, so I would like to be informed and of what's going on around. In Fargo, Christina Craig, Valley News Live. Fargo police say they typically see spikes in car break-ins in the cold winter months and when the weather starts to warm up again. Usually these criminals just pull on door handles until one opens.